This is how to install a tiny web gallery. Um, I'm installing it on my computer, Linux with Apache. Follow these same instructions to download it, unpack it, and you can upload it to your website. So we're going to go to the Tiny Web Galleries website. Click on download. Download the zip version. Now we're going to move that into my slash op slash lamp slash htdocs directory. So use the mv command in the terminal. There are zip files in the htdocs directory. So now we need to extract it. Double click, drag and drop. I'm going to follow the instructions on the TWG website for changing file permissions. So right click the cache folder, go to properties, permissions, and we need to assign create and delete files to all of these. This is just like doing a chmod 777 from the terminal. And when you get done with that, click apply. Close it. Then go to the counters folder and do the same thing. And next we need to go to XML and change the permissions on that folder. Now we need to search for myconfig.php and change the permissions on this file to read and write. and do the same thing to mystyle.css Okay, the next step go into the admin folder 
config. Right click to show hidden files. We're going to change the permission on htusers.php. Okay, go to our web browser. 127.0.0.1 is my local host here. Go to folder dwg24 and go to info.php. We'll see how our install looks. Everything looks good. Uh, FFmpeg support, I may make that available later. Everything else looks good. It's green. Next recommended step, we're going to go to TWG24 admin index.php. Enter the default username and password. And here we're going to change the administrator's password for TWG. Enter the old password, and then enter your new password twice. Click Change. You can see up top it says our password is changed. And next we're going to click on configure TWG on the left menu there. And here on this page we've got our protected galleries password which I'll do in another video. And you got tons of options. There's our default upload method. Make sure flash is selected. Here's some of the other options, generate cache, extract data from images, clean cache. So we'll try to save that. And up there it says TWG main folder is not writable. So we're going to have to go back to file manager. Go up a folder to HD docs, right click on TWG 24, change the permissions. Create and delete files. Apply and close. Try that again. And there it says my config.php was saved. Everything's looking good here. Some more options, generating a encrypted passwords, debug files. On the image tab, this is for your galleries, how many columns, how many rows. You gotta pay attention to size of the thumbnails, which is 120, in case you create your own custom thumbnails. Okay, let's try to upload some images. 
click on run Adobe Flash if that pops up. So here we can create folders and upload files. To create a folder, click on the options button. Create folder. I'm going to call it Bald Eagles. Click create. You can see the folder on the left. Let's enter the folder. And we're going to upload some files by clicking add files. Select one or more files here. And on the freeware version or unregistered, you have to type in a code if your queue is more than three megabytes. After you enter the code, click OK. And then upload. I'm going to upload a few more files. Type in the code again. Now it's time to check on our gallery. Which would be in the main folder index.php. And those top four galleries are the test galleries. And this is my bald eagle directory. You can move through this with the green arrows at the top. You got forward and back, beginning and end, and the green arrow goes back up to the main gallery. And you've also got a slideshow option. You can just click that icon to turn it on and off. You've also got options here to rotate images left and right. and you can vote on different images. And the last recommended item is to delete info.php from the main folder. And that's it for now. Thanks for watching.